Today in our video, we're going to talk about dynamic themes. Dynamic themes are a set of scans that are applied or made available at the application level. Themes let you specify common scans for widgets in different states for each individual widget in your application, such as normal, unfocused, enabled, or disabled. You can define your own themes in the Kony Studio, or you can download those themes via the network and use them in your application. This is the Kony Studio. Inside the Kony Studio's layout editor, we have a form. In our form, we have widgets. We have three label widgets, and the label widgets are used to display textual information. We have a button, and a button is used when you want to create an event to do something, maybe like call a web service or invoke another function. Widgets are controlled by properties. These properties may control general aspects of a widget, or it may be device-specific properties, where you're controlling something that is specific to a particular device. Scans control the look and feel of a single widget. Where we have themes, themes are a set of scans that are applied across an application. In the themes pane is where we add a new theme. Let's add a new theme called Silver. Once we've added a new theme, we'll see that default skins have been created for all widgets. Let's take a look at the form skin. The default skin for our silver theme is the same as the default for the system. But I have created two other themes. I have gold theme and we have a standards theme which we see contain a different background than our defaults. Themes can be imported, exported, and cloned. Here we have our source platform, which is iPhone. We can clone this out to other platform or other channels. We have our native application channel. We have our tablet channels. We have our desktop and the mobile web channels. Every application has to have a current theme. That's the theme that your application is currently using. Here you can set it as default or one of the other predefined themes. Every application will have a default theme which cannot be deleted. It can be modified but not deleted. While your current application theme is set at development time, dynamic themes are loaded at runtime. Kony provides a rich set of APIs to allow the developer to define new themes, to delete new themes, to apply those themes to an application, to switch the application from one theme to another. Here, we're using the set current theme to set the gold theme. Standard here as well. In this piece of code, we're determining whether a theme is present. If it's present, we set the theme. If it's not, we make a remote call to a server and retrieve a theme and set that theme within our application. Now let's take a look at our app. In our application, we have two forms. The application is running on Android native emulator. Um, it can run in mobile web as well. Uh, with mobile web, we utilize the CSS files for the themes and the CSS files are automatically generated for all targeted mobile channels. Our two themes that we're looking at today are locally packaged with the application. They're going to be gold and blue themes. The gold theme is defined in our application as gold. The blue theme is defined in our application as standard. The remote theme will be dynamically loaded from a remote server. So let's get started. We'll click on continue and in the continue screen we'll see products here with the price and the ratings of particular products. 
when we select the go, we're going to invoke the go theme dynamically. As you can see, the background has changed and the text has changed as well. When we go back to the home screen, we'll see that our theme is still in effect. So once we invoke a theme dynamically, the theme stays in effect in the application. So let's go back and change the theme again. This time we're going to select the blue theme. With the blue theme selected, you'll see that our button has changed now and our background has changed and our um, segment has changed here uh, as well. So let's go back home to our home screen and verify the change that's taking place on our home screen. We see on the home screen that our button has changed. That's because this new theme changed all of the, the buttons, uh, the background images, the text are all different now. So now let's invoke um, our remote theme. We select our remote theme and we'll see that our remote theme changed everything as well. Our background has changed, our button has changed back to the original form and our text has changed here as well. We see the, the green text and Now let's go back to our home form and verify that our changes have taken effect there. So, and you can see that they have. Now, this concludes our, our demonstration, but this just shows the dynamic capabilities that you can uh, dynamically change the look and feel of your application to give it that rich feel. If you have a marketing campaign going on, or maybe certain branding on certain pages, uh, you can change those uh, dynamically on the fly.